So smart tagging for the private media you upload into Canva, what does it mean? Well, for example, if you upload an image, let's take this image of myself, okay, that I nicely took in our kitchen for a thumbnail, not my best photo, but if you have already uploaded your media into Canva, you can click on these three little dots right here. And the first section of the description of the video, you see, I don't even have a title for this photo. You should see right here, the smart tags, okay? These tags with the little AI sparkle next to them. So these tags have been auto-generated by the AI so you see fridge, kitchen, pan, food, plate, hungry. But yeah, so this is pretty cool. I can edit that so I can delete them. I can add more tags. I'm not sure if I add one, maybe glasses. It will not have the little AI sparkle next to it because this is a tag that I manually added to the description. So yeah, the novelty is this right here, this section with the auto-generated tag. So let's take another example right here. For example, this media right here. Okay, that's a little Ganesha with like a traditional outfit let's see so elephants tradition candle book adorable festival yeah that's pretty cool uh, last one let's see what they have to say about the canva logo there you go format gradient file extension illustration this one computer sound audio tech eyeglasses voice keyboard online mic yep that's pretty accurate for this photo right here. It works as well from the Canva homepage. So if I go and click on my projects and go to my images, I have the same images right here. So for example, the Learn AI with Rondi logo. Let's see, we have AI, robots, tech, digital, illustration, artificial coding and learn. Okay, yeah, why not?